Alright, so this question is minimum time to type word using special typewriter. And alright. And let's I'm gonna I'm going to explain the question in my own definition. So you got a spinner, something like this, and um, you want to type a letter, then you will spin this uh, what uh, what is called like a tool, right? So if you want to say, oh, I want to type A, and I'm starting A, right? And I will just enter A, so it will be one second. And then if I want to move to C, right? I will just, you know, go twice, you know, uh, twice to the right, and then I will plus C for the time, right? Uh, if you look at the look at the construction, uh, it's starting at letter A, right? Initial starting at letter A, and you can go counterclockwise or clockwise. So if you at letter A, and then if you want to type Z, um, you don't want to go all the way from you know um, clockwise to here. You you can actually do you know counterclockwise, you know, one step to the left, and then you get it, right? So that would be the solution. So how many? So what do you want to return? Return the minimum number of a second to type the character in the word, right? So um, we want to find out like what is the current position, the current value from here, uh, sorry, from here to the previous value. So we want to find out the previous value. The previous value is what the value you were had. So imagine that you are at right here. You, I mean, the initial value is A, right? But the next character is G, right? So from A to G, you know, there's a distance. You either go clockwise or counterclockwise. And then you want to find out, like, what is the value you should add into your result? Because it has to be in the minimum, right? So we want to find out which one is, you know, which one has a better option, right? So we have to compare clockwise and counterclockwise. So this will be the solution. All right, how do I do this? Traverse um, a clock, right? So I'm going to say int result. So I'm going to initialize to the worst of length, right? And then my previous value should be what? Letter A, right? So initially it was starting at letter A. And I'm going to traverse my worst of char array. And definitely, I'm going to return return result, right? Alright, so let's look at this. So I'm going to say the diff is going to be what the absolute value between uh, C minus previous. So it has to be a positive number. So at least in this scenario, I don't care if it's counterclockwise or clockwise. I mean, I know it's one of them, right? So the other direction is going to be what? 26 minus a D, right? So um, the other direction is going to be, um, uh, how do I say this? Another way, something like this. Another way goes to 26 minus D, right? And then the result will plus equal. I mean, you have to keep adding, right? So it's going to be minimum between the D and another way, something like this, right? And don't, don't forget you want to update your pre to the current charge. Right, let's look at this. Yeah. So for the time and space, this space constant times all of them. Yeah. So a little bit improvement is going to be we don't need a, another wave variable, we can just do this. Um this plus and then submit. And if you feel this is irrelevant, you can do this. Run. Mm, oh, then this happy. This has to be this guy. And something. All right. So which one you prefer? I mean, all of them work, but I would prefer this one. Oh, sorry, this one. This is actually more readable and understandable. And the time and space. You know, all all of them for the time, space for the constant. And if you have question, leave a comma, and I'll see you later. Bye.